Alright, this is Rosie. I don't know if you can see her. She's my tarantula. Um, she is about 10 years old. And I, um, I feed her crickets and... Um, <laughs> what? what else? Um, they can eat pinkies. Yeah, they can eat pinkies. It's your little tiny mice. Um, scientific name for rose-haired tarantula is Grimostola rosia. It kind of sounds like Grandma Stola rosia. So my grandma apparently stole my spider. So she's pretty yeah. cool. We just recently started holding her. She's not really used to being held that much. Yeah, she's not really used to being held that much, so we're trying to be easy with her because there's some that you, they're so calm that you can pull the web right out of them. There's some that, well, that are kind of mean, and we're not sure which one she is yet, so. <laughs> I hope it's not mean. Yeah. They live in warm habitats and stuff and they live in burrows yes they do live in burrows we have a um a heating um the tank heats on the bottom so she can go to either side most of the time well actually i'm not sure which side she stays on because well i'm not sure which side is the heated side she has these really cool feet that look like they have tiny claws on them I'm not sure how, but I have seen her climb up glass. You have? Yeah, it was pretty cool. And if my voice sounds a little stuffy or anything today, I'm just... I'm fighting some allergies. Do you have a cold? No, I don't have a cold. She only looks like she has one eye, but she has more than one eye. She's molted... Um, one time since I've had her, and, um, only once? Yeah, only once. I have the skin. Here, let me get it. If I can find it, I'll try. Ugh. Oh, here it is. Excuse me. The whole lunchbox I have. Have her skin out. Let's see. This there is, sheds this is some, of, some of her skin that she shed. I think she's grown a little. Yeah, I think so too. I don't think she could fit in her old skin. If you look at her fangs, if I can get them out. Um, Try showing things on Rosie, but yeah, there's Rosie's thing right here. There's Rosie's fangs. She can see them under there. You have one. This is the thing. It's like a fishing hook almost. I mean, Designed to go in and lock in. And. To kind of fold up on there, so if Rosie bit me, she'd have to raise up all the way like this. Yeah, right. she has to kind of cock herself back before she can last down. She can't just stick her in. So, and if you they were can, holding her, she would give you a warning. And they can, if they get scared, they can fling the hairs off of them and all they these burn hairs on the back. And I think if you get them in your eye, it, it damages your it damages your eye. Probably. I think I've heard that they it might blind you. I'm not sure if that's a myth or not. Probably. I don't know if you'd stay blind, but... Oh, yeah, you might get blind for a little bit. It's her leg. Her... I wonder if she shed her eye. <laughs> oh, she did shed her eye. Of course, like that. <laughs> Probably because of her eye. That's weird to shed well, an eye. It's more than one eye, but... I mean, shed eyes, but... So many... It'll look like one. But I can't find her, her abdomen. 
I never could find her abdomen. Hmm. I know she shed it because she was shiny when she got done. Nice and shiny. Shiny. Anything else that we're leaving out? I don't think so. Uh, if you have any questions, just comment.